In Dalpine, in, Van, brand name Upstein, developmental code name LM5008, is a selective serotonin reuptake inhibitor, SSRI, class drug that was briefly marketed. It was discovered in 1977 by the pharmacologists Lafer and Uzin at Pharmuca, a small French pharmaceutical firm, who credit Baron Shopson and his colleagues at NYU Bellevue, NYU School of Medicine in New York with providing the basis for their work. They were particularly influenced by the series of synthesis inhibitor studies carried out by Shopson's team during the early to mid-1970s, and in particular, the clinical report by Shopson et al., 1976, relating to PCPA. S. Rapid reversal of antidepressant response to tranylcypramine in depressed patients. This led to an understanding of the role of the monoamine neurotransmitter serotonin 5-hydroxytryptamine, or 5-HT, in the therapeutic effects of the available tricyclic and Maui class antidepressants. The studies led to widespread recognition of a serotonin hypothesis of depression, contradicting theories that promoted the role of norepinephrine. History while citalopram and zimilidine were developed in the early 1970s, it was Pharmuca's in Dalpine that was first to reach the market. Baron Shopson was recruited as consultant to Pharmuca throughout a research and development process that resulted in the marketing of Indalpine in France and then worldwide, in 1982. With FDA approval of Pharmuca. S. Ein's submission to conduct clinical studies within Dalpine and Vicolin, Shopson carried out and published the first clinical trials with these drugs in depressed outpatients in the U.S. Astra. SSSRI zimilidine was marketed within a year, 1983, but the next crop of SSRI's DIDN. T become commercially available until the 1986 marketing of fluvoxamine in Belgium by Dufar, followed by approval in the United States later that year. Lily's fluoxetine Prozac was approved in the U.S. in 1987. Meanwhile, zimilidine had been withdrawn soon after its marketing in 1983 due to the emergence of Guillain-Barre syndrome, a serious neurological disease. With lingering concerns among some common market countries and activist groups about the potential of SSRIs to induce adverse effects, and the reported association between indalpine and hematological effects, which emerged in the aftermath of Pharmuca. S takeover by Rhone Poolink, Indalpine was abruptly taken off the market by Rhone Poolink. Irish psychiatrist David Healy characterized Indalpine as being born at the wrong time, during a period when Indalpine and psychiatry was under siege by different interest groups in some of the common market countries. In line with Indalpine. As fate, research and development was halted relating to the two other 4-alkylpiperidine derivatives developed by Pharmuca, Viquiline, a serotonin-releasing agent, and Pipiquiline, a GABAA receptor-positive allosteric modulator, both in different stages of development at the time. Recently, revision of this molecular motif yielded CERT inhibitors with nanomolar and subnanomolar IC50 values. References <laughs>